I love international travel and visiting different countries. The food has a different flavour, the air smells altogether different, even the difference in weather is fascinating. I marvel at people laughing and speaking languages I can't understand. I take photos of the houses and the trees because they are so alien. There are new sites to visit and fresh experiences to discover. It is no wonder that most of us choose to spend our holidays dabbling in this enriching cross-cultural treat. It gives us a taste of heaven, which I am told will involve a gathering together of all nations, tribes and languages. We shouldn't be surprised to see a glimpse of this international celebration when Jesus is born on earth. The global hospitality of God is visible in the Nativity narrative as God creates an unmissable stellar event so that scholars from the East get the birth announcement for his son in a language they can understand. After Jesus was born in Bethlehem in Judea, during the time of King Herod, Magi from the East came to Jerusalem and asked, where is the one who is born to be King of the Jews? We saw his star when it rose and have come to worship him. I wonder if your Christmas celebration reflects this international spirit. Why not consider this year including other cultures and traditions or those from different places around the world and see if you can enjoy and share a taste of heaven too. Thank you for joining us on the Season of Sanctuary Advent Journey, looking at the themes of welcome and hospitality that lie at the heart of the Christmas story. As you prepare your hearts and homes for Christmas, please consider opening doors of hope for those around you. For more inspiration and information, please visit our website, sanctuaryfoundation.org.uk.